Today's story isn't about hydraulics here in Birmingham, as the building behind me might suggest. This is a company that is evolving extremely quickly and has set up a new division, and that's what we're going to talk about today. Uh, AM Tooling was started in January this year. Um, about 12 months ago, um, uh, I used to outsource a lot of work to AIM Hydraulics. Uh, they provided very good service in specialist large press tooling. Um, cut long story short, um, I decided to join the business. We started here in January um, with, the, uh, with the remit to expand the offering, to increase the capacity, to manufacture more UK press tooling. Um, historically, over the last five, six years, lots went to China and overseas cheap economies. That trend is now changing, uh, the UK is becoming more competitive, we have a, a fast turnaround and a very good technical offering. So the, the idea was to expand that technical offering, um, especially in the UK uh, and our um, uh, European markets, uh, German markets, and really um, get UK manufacturing back on, back on the map. Some of the machines we purchased, a brand new um, warring machine from Fanuc. Again, we researched the market, looked at various competitors. Fanuc could give us the, the availability, the support, the training, and the machine offered the, the technical capability and the user interface that we required here with, with the Fanuc system. Dan, you're part of this dream team here at AM Tooling. You've recently started, uh, you were brought into the business. What was your experience? What were you doing before? Uh, I used to do CNC milling. Um, I used to programme for 15 different machines uh, for a day and night shift. Um, in a Midlands company uh, in Baden Road. So you are very much hands-on here in the factory. Yes. This, this is call it your baby, your cell. Um, how did you go about learning how to use this wire technology from Fanuc? And what advantages do you see to using this sort of concept of, of manufacturing? Um, so the, it started off, they sent me on a training course, went on, the, on a week's training course with another, uh, another employee. Um, and then after the following course we didn't actually have the uh, wire installed so we came to an agreement where they'd support us during our production uh, demands and I stayed with one of their tech guys and wired additional jobs using their machines and their facility so that we had good support from them the whole time. So, yeah. oh, wow, what, what way to learn. So you're actually at Anstey yeah. Park and Fanet in there and yeah. they're making components uh, for you as part of the yeah. package that you agreed and you're learning how to do that along the way. Well that's it. We did the training course but the the amount of experience I learned afterwards was just uh, yeah, second to none really, yeah, it was definitely a massive benefit. What about things like the accuracy and surface finish that you're able to generate from here? Some of your components, I said already, not only they're big, but you know, they are, they are pretty tasty uh, and they've got good surface finishes. Can, can you do that with these machines? Yeah, you, you're able to uh, keep up with the actual uh, surface finishes that they dem the customer demands uh, and the tolerances is all down to the amount of cuts you need to take on the component. Um, it can work up to a, a two to three microns, depending on how many cuts. We have an ambitious growth plan uh, to increase uh, further. Um, we are building, um, putting these building blocks in place to facilitate that. Uh, we've already secured uh, 10 new customers uh, on the AM tooling side and we're looking to grow that even further. Uh, we are getting reoccurring work from existing customer bases, which is encouraging, which just shows we're offering a good product, good, uh, good service. Uh, I envisage that we'll be purchasing two more wiring machines in the next 12 months and a large um, CNC uh, gantry bed milling machine as well. So there you have it, what a story. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all here at AM Hydraulics and AM Tooling for accommodating us uh, today. And no doubt like we have been in the past few years, we'll be back here again as the business continues to expand.